It's just like, hey man, those platforms. I wanna, I want it to be what I expect it to be. I think PS1 just also looks like aesthetically worse. But that's because like it has, it looks more like melee style. Really, the the one from melee? Yeah, isn't Nick Wilds? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, uh, balls starting up. Jesus, now I'm doing it. Uh, <laughs> well, well, to be fair, I was looking at the the game feed without the overlay. But uh, yeah, Nell starting off with uh, getting some damage going in. Only taking 12 right now. Mouse Rat already kind of back against the uh, death's door for that first stock. Woo! Pikachu's very light, so if he's already like having trouble getting in and just like taking all these hits, uh, that could prove to be quite cumbersome for him. Still only dealing 12 damage. Almost an entire minute has passed. Oh, whoa. Getting a quick attack. Jeez. He changed into the Megawatt during the hit stun and then just got the Nair out, just snuck it out. Oh my god, this full stock lead now. 15 damage. Oh, all right. Maltrap proving that he's got a pulse. He's got something. He's gonna try and make it go, but uh, Nell doesn't let it ha happen too too long. Maltrap did promise this is gonna be an one-hour set, but it looks like Nell has other ideas. Cause Nell is definitely playing like super aggressive, even if it's like I'm keeping it arm's distance. Haha. Uh -huh. Oh my God! And the ram and the ram ram like. Uh, gets rid of the T jolt, which I mean, no one is surprised by this, but like, what coverage? Is Trago really well still online? No. Okay. I can tell by his arms. Yeah, that's what I was looking for. Are you looking for that orange? Yeah, trying to find that beefy arm. Yeah, you really just gotta make sure that you just, you know, even though you made it past uh, one swing, the next one is coming. Okay, okay, respect. All right. The BI from uh, Null, though. Uh, this might be the stock unless Mouse Rat messes up. Jumped a bit too early, left the ledge a bit too early, uh, and mm -hmm. wasn't able to get high enough to kind of sink with uh, Null. Now Null is with a two stock lead here. You can see, like, Null's like, really looking for those spot touch rates. Whenever, uh, whenever they land a hit at a certain distance, they're like, all right, if you're going to spot dodge. And uh, they've been right a few times. Not every time, though. But it's been pretty useful. You have the beefy arm online, and now it's offline again. Yeah. When you grab him back, uh, Trogdar goes back to the early 2000s. Whoa. Hmm. All right. Mousetrat finally taking that first stock, but still full stock lead for Null. You know, it is a five. It is a five-match uh, set. So, uh, Mouse Red has Ooh. a little bit of room to experiment Ooh. in a Ooh. pretty good amount of damage. Good pursuit. All Mouse right, Red. now get the stock and then do that again. <laughs> do that again, but this time make him not. Take. Like, what do you do about like a minimum just up smashing? You? I, don't, I don't think there's much you can. Wow. Okay. Okay. Bad reactions. <laughs> yeah, for real. Okay, good. That was a jump off the ledge, though, so he still has a jump. Didn't need to use it. Oh my god. Something I want to see is that if he does thunder like that, I want to see Min Min run undo up smash or up tilt to get the reflector to hit Pikachu below the stage. You know, I really like the fact that uh, the Null ne never pulls out Mega One until it's finally time to do the deed. Good down smash out of Nair to take the stock, but a love tap from a Nair, not from a Bear, maybe one, not quite enough. Uh oh. Yeah, she doesn't have any rage, so he's gonna be, he has a little bit more of a lease on life. But this is still gonna be rough because he's got to approach a character that has a very active hitbox, no matter which way she's swinging. That also like uh, goodbye. Okay. Yeah, he's very strong uh, first game for Null. His best of five. Uh, 
Let's see what Mouse Rat uh, can do to adapt. But yeah. Adapt uh, or die. I, do you think we're going to see the same stage? I don't know, man. Looks like uh, Null's been doing just a really good job of pushing people onto the ledge. And it's like, that's been like the big thing that's been causing people to die uh, throughout the match. It's like they, she, they force, Null forces them to try to rush back on. And eventually they end up losing their stock because they're trying to uh, force their way in. Even though Min Min has a, uh, not kill setups, but she has good ways to cover space. You know, Mouse Rider did a really good job. Like it was a, uh, it was, it was getting three stocks, and then he started figuring something out. Question is, like, is he gonna be able to carry that those adaptations into winning a match? We'll see in a moment as we go into game two. What stage are we going to? It is Smashville. Interesting choice. Yep. Considering the fact that Min Min um, can use the platform really well in order to, to kind of hang out underneath and then try to force people to approach her linearly, uh, this is a very interesting choice from uh, Mouse Trap's counter pick. And clearly, Mouse Trap chose it as a uh, comfort pick. He's something that, uh, that that Null likes to do a lot is that he just throws out both of his punches and then immediately uh, either jumps if he notices the opponent is rushing towards him. Slash using a grounded movement option. Or he just uh, backs off a little bit to reset himself and then he does it again. So like, that's one of the things that makes it really hard to get in our Although we have mostly seen Null fighting characters that, uh, that tend to jump in. So that might be a big part of it. But the fact that, uh, that Null is using that, that third... Uh, <clears throat> is using uh, the vertical aspects of women's movements to move around and make it harder to hit it is really valuable. You can see each time that Min Min does get hit, it tends to take a fair amount of damage, but that happens so rarely. Alright, good job by uh, Mouse Rat getting Min Min off the stage, and that is going to be it. This character's recovery is not great. If she uses up her second jump, she's going to have a hard time coming back to the stage. So Pikachu is one of the ideal characters for actually gimping her. Now getting in, on the other hand, is a totally different question. And that's something that can be really difficult if you're not, uh... If you're trying to get in. And a really interesting combo there. Down so it's an up smash coming out of no. Very nicely done. <gasps> And the dragon barely whiffing Pikachu's head. Full strength dragon definitely would have killed at that percent. Alright. Oh, okay. Welcome back. See, we have even stocks here, but Mouse Rat's almost on his last. Mouse Rat got a really good game off the stage um, against Null. That's kind of what you don't want to hear for Mouse Rat, just because like if if you got a Gimp and then it's still like kind of losing and stuff, but you got yeah, that yeah, lost Smash kill. Stock. Yeah, I mean it's Min Min, so it's like if she uh, she's very dominant on the stage. Mouse Rat has to figure out how to get in, and he has, jeez man, that up oh, that tail, putting in work for Mouse Rat right now. All right, oh. Mouse Rat's doing a really good job now, but, but he got didn't really. Away. Yeah, it didn't. It also really didn't amount to too much uh, of a percent. It was really more of a positioning, and yeah, that falling megawatt in air gonna take that second stock, evening it up. 60 damage. Let's see what Mouse Rat can do with it. Attack on two. Something that Null's been doing a lot, and Mouse Rat kind of caught it on too, was the fact that every time after uh, Null did two F tilts, uh, Null would jump. And now Null is like, okay, Mouse Rat's kind of new this. I need to start mixing it up and just stay surrounded at times. Alright, Mouse Rat definitely is in control right now. Oh, is that it? Yep. Not yet. Yeah. Ooh, That's definitely ooh. it. No! Great! Very nice. Heck! 
I was so sure that was going to be it because she wouldn't have enough mobility to get back on the stage. But that was a great tech. No. Or to get back under the ledge, is what I meant. The mouse rat holding a pretty solid lead. Very good. And there it is, the dash attack on the roll away, and Mouse Rat takes game two. Alright. So what's left is effectively a best of three. Whoever wins this next game is going to have counter pick advantage if we end up going to game five. I kind of wanted to see, once he forced the uh, re-grab, instead of going for that jab, why not, like, charge down smash? Because, like, she can't wait on the ledge. Uh, she can't hang on the ledge very long. Uh, it I mean, will just auto-pull in. That's true, but remember the fact that, like, it was the same end result. Down smash can't, uh... If a down smash clips her from above, it's gonna have set knockback. She's probably gonna drop her out from underneath. And with jab, at I least... I mean, if it clips, it. sure, but I kinda don't think it would have. I mean, I mean, regardless. Do you think that a down smash would have sucked her into the, into yeah. the down smash itself fully? Yeah. Hmm, interesting. I'm not so sure about that, but maybe. So apparently now there's a Chips Ahoy McFlurry from MGW. On my way. Apparently. Oh my god. I love Milky man. They discovered oat milk, and that stuff is pretty good, and it doesn't have the incredible uh, moral pain that almond milk has. Of what the water consumption used to make it? Yeah. Man, you're really talking about the morals of milk, but not referring to regular milk. <laughs> no, I mean, regular milk is still probably more amoral than, than almond milk. But almond milk is still more amoral than oat milk, which is almost, like, way less water and energy yeah. to produce. Alright, well, game three, PS2. Where did... Was this where we were game one? Yes, it was. Okay. So I was I found the uh, the, the decision to counterpick this match really interesting for Mouse Rat because while yes it does give uh, it gave Mouse Rat less space to have to deal with against the null, it also had the platform in the center, which Min Min is very fond of because that means that she uh, she keeps her head in the shade. Yeah. And also like makes it hard for people to jump drop down on her. But as Mouse Rat showed, uh, he was able to just be like it's close quarters, so you're not gonna be able to get away from me to get those sorts of setups for that situation. So I think in that in that respect, yeah, no opting to go for the more space to get those uh, situations more. Oh boy! Ah, Mousetrap holding shield a lot, and, and Null's noticing. Very good. Yeah. Beefy arm like, on online. Like Mousetrap doesn't have much of a choice, especially when Ram is out, because of the, uh, the amount of space that it covers. But it's still like you have to you have to realize when you get the top shield and just try to punish. Like it is laggy. That's kind of the whole point of it. Is that that grab is laggy? I, I would like to see sometimes Pikachu going in without T jolt because I I want to see like more a, more of a vertical like approach because like Pikachu has a really good nair. He does. Down air and fair. And it's just like the so positioning what, you need for those, you wouldn't necessarily use t -Dol. And like, yeah. And like the one thing that I feel like Null's been doing really well that a lot of other Mimmons don't do really enough is that they're using the uh, the fact that Mimmon does have a jump. It's not great, but it, you, they do have a, they, she does have a jump, which offers her a little bit of, oh, I feel like you need to charge smash or something. Yeah. All right, but oh my god, the kids. like, one of the few last hits of back air. Yeah, no, you fastball back air is really potent as a uh, as a uh, edge guard tool. And you know what? Yeah, I I, I didn't agree with the uh, the decision to use down smash. But that was really smart uh, for Mouse Rat. He went for something that was guaranteed to kill. That had uh, I gave him a really good opportunity to jump in. And the pressure is insane right now. From Mouse Rat. Never mind, it evaporated. Oh yeah, it's back. <laughs> All right, Mouse Rat's taking control, but Null's not going down without a fight. Oh, 
I don't know if anyone can answer this, but are all of um are all of Min Min's moves on the same stale queue? Like if she uses uh, Ram Ram, is it on the same stale queue as Megawatt? Like for the same moves? I would assume they are. Yeah, I would assume they are, but yeah. Oh, this is a great song for this. Yeah, we're just getting wacky here. That's definitely how it feels. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, he's dead. Oh, wait, never mind. <laughs> he is dead, though. Yeah, I would presume that, uh, that they are in the same style. But, like, the incredible amount of power that Megawatt has just means that usually doesn't matter. Because, like, something like Nair is just gonna kill. And I really like the way that Nair's been using Nair to kill with, uh, with Megawatt once their once their opponents get to a certain percent. Alright. Nice grab. Yeah. Alright, could use the Thunder Jolt and Quick Attack to come in, getting into good damage. This could be the match for Mouse Rat if they make good read. This is honestly a great yep. position to have Trogdor, because like if he's able to land the, the strong hit, that could be death. Whoa, yeah. That's the first time that they, that uh, that Null's landed that very nicely done. Trogdor! I don't know what you said. I really like the way that Null is DIing stuff, specifically to avoid. Oh, wow, that charge is so good. It's like, yeah, you probably shouldn't have been charging that, uh, that Skull Bash, dude. I don't know what to tell you. That's... And this puts you in a very bad position because now you have to deal with her counterpick. Which, granted, that was your, uh, she counterpicked back to your starter. Which is, like, not a bad deal for you. But it's gonna, you're gonna be at a bit of a disadvantage. So apparently there's like a Smash clone, there's like like Kirby, there's Kirby Fighters 2, which is more, which feels very much like a Smash clone, I don't know. Uh, okay. Ooh. Hmm. Alright, so now no on set point here. Gonna make it the winner's finals if he wins this. Yep. Okay, Kalos. Good choice. Yeah, pretty uh, pretty standard counter pick by Mouse Rat. Um, large blast zones. Um, platform effectiveness is significantly reduced. Yeah. She uh, if she uses the platforms in order. To Oh, oh, baby. Yeah, yep, I, I, you, I see what you're saying. You're saying, like, if she wants a, uh, a roof above her head, now she's got to be literally at the ledge. Yep, and yeah. if she wants to jump away, she's going to be on a... Jesus Christ. Mouse, mouse rat! rat! Dude, come on. come on! Plus the fact that, uh, you know, and the stage is uh, a bit smaller than PS2. Yep, there's also the fact that if uh, Mouse Rat throws a Thunder Jolt down the wall, there's a very strong chance that it's going to hit Min Min. She, uh, she upbeats if she doesn't attract immediately. I'm so disappointed. Uh, there's just a lot of things that like makes this a really good stage for Pikachu in this matchup. And I'm very surprised that, um, that Null didn't ban it, honestly, but it's not necessarily a bad stage for her. It's just that the way that Null has been playing the matchup thus far makes it less optimal. How much, like, pee, pee does Pikachu have to use all those quick attacks? Uh, well, quick attack, I'm pretty sure, is a, is a 30 PP move. Hmm. So, yeah, he's definitely cheating. Yeah, I gotta see more struggles. <laughs> I mean, we're all struggling right now. <sighs> Ain't it the truth, brother? Anyway. <laughs> uh... All right, I like the attempt. Oh, got a little bit greedy. You should know better that you can't grab 
Like that. Boom, boom. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> and there... Jesus. Pikachu wasn't even on stage for a frame after that hit. That is the uh, deletion. Yeah. Yo, good roll, Reed. Just needed to wait a little bit. Imagine if Mouserat didn't immediately SD after taking that super cool lead. Imagine if Mouserat didn't kill uh, Null at like zero Ooh, because of Thunder Jolt hitting. I mean, this is looking uh, more and more like it's going to be Null's game, but you know, Mouserat, he's got to try to take oh, the stock be right it. now. Yeah, Very is. nice. Yeah, it was like 180 after hit or something. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm sure like that. Yeah, like you can tell, like he's get, even though there's not too much interaction, like the harassment game, like he's de dealing a lot of percent. Okay, all right, Malstrad finally putting something together here. He's okay. feeling himself. Ooh, I like that. Null did the down air where it, it ran out before, uh, before she hit the ground. Yeah, it's so very gonna, Sonic. Yeah, I was gonna say it's just like Sonic. Which I kind of hate that. <laughs> it's the same goddamn move. Yeah. Commit to your down airs like Sheik does. Or, or beer boot. Oh my goodness. Maybe he's trying to do the same thing again. Wait, what? How did the Thunder Jolt not hit her? <laughs> she yeah, ran out of really uh, grab range. I feel when you don't react to the grab, but uh, it didn't matter because they whiffed it by like ever so little. It'd be really funny to me if that grab ended up being the thing. That grab whiffing ended up being the thing that determines the match. God, this is such a scary situation. And oh, is Mouse no. Red dead? No? Okay. Oh my. Oh, he's... Scary normal getup. Yeah, no, it's terrifying. But this isn't even game five. This is in fact game four though, but this is uh this is Mouse Rat's last chance to turn around this set. It is it's such a scary situation to be in. I yeah, like, if he I gets like hit by Nair, he's done bro. Yeah, I like that he faded on that shield. Didn't want to risk an up smash or something. Or a Nair. Or... There were... <laughs> <gasps> oh! 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 Don't! Whoa, no. okay. You're looking for the up Good. smash right there. And dash Good. attack! Oh, man. Barely surviving that, too. Very nice. Yo! <laughs> the T-Jolts. We got the 3v1 right there. Bro, that's what we call a bookend. It was like the, the story starting the exact same way that it ended. Yeah. Yeah. So that's a, that's a great bookend. Right God, there. that was a... Uh, look at those T-Jills, the way they were spaced out. Like that one, and then boom, and then nah. Because you like, can't... Bro, why'd you swing at me? You could have grabbed the ledge. You would have been fine. What are you doing? You can't touch the ledge uh, for 55 frames after taking a hit. So a big tether, yeah. With anything. No, yeah, I mean, but like with tethers, specifically when it matters, because uh, that's the only the only way that you can typically try to grab the ledge immediately, unless you have a char unless your character has like a crazy ledge nap on their uh, on their up B, or you just air dodge in. Oh man, here's that uh, shield break. <laughs> okay, he was on for more than a few frames. <laughs> that's still so he fast. He definitely got deleted. Yeah, absolutely. As for whether, as for whether he got deleted, uh. At like warp speed. Quickly. He was up yeah, there. Broke the sound barrier. A man's managed to avoid choking. <laughs> and he also, like, a great counter pick choice, honestly, for that was right. Yeah, but now we have to go to Null's counter pick. Which is probably going to be PS2. Yeah, we might see PS2 again. I mean, this is actually the first. Yeah, this is the first. Uh, the first match, this uh, this first set, this tournament that uh, that Noel has dropped a match. <sighs> oh wow. Back to Kalos. Oh, okay. okay. So it seems that like, even though when uh, Maltra was like, let's go to Kalos, he was just like, yes, good. Yes, yeah, so let's go to Kalos. I like that. So do you think, do, do you think, do you think that, that Noah's just watching, is listening? 
I was like, I'm gonna prove these schmucks wrong. Kalos is a great stage for for, uh, for Min Min. Okay, freaking Mouse Rat trying to be Charizard right there. Hey, bro. Oh Are you my. telling me that the Flare Blitz isn't good on Pikachu? Give, it's not a tournament viable move. Give Pikachu Flare Blitz. <laughs> Terrifying. <laughs> That's what nightmares are made of. Yo, let's go. No, with taking the early lead. He's like, no more games, bro. It's fine. Stop it. Yeah, Mouse Rat though. Uh, right now in an advantageous position, but oh no, nope, not not relinquishing it yet, just yet. Can he seal out the stock? Oh, Ooh, very good. And close there. Went into the grab. Yeah, that high state, high ceiling is definitely gonna help out Null. Yeah, remember Pikachu has less vulnerability if he gets hit by Thunder too. Nice, than, yeah. that's a stock. Yep. Are you kidding me? That was pretty good. Yeah, that was kind of like a more normal sort of game because he was kind of just like with the T jolt, so it's like if you're doing a regular hitbox. We did it with Thunder Jolts. I'm like, I was, I was expecting like drag down Nair or something. Or not nah, you just gotta tools. tap them. That's the thing about tethers. You just gotta tap them. Give him a little love tap. Yeah. The worst look, thing. Look, you I don't do... hate you. That's why I'm not trying to kill you outright. <laughs> but just... you know, go away. It's it's totally the uh, the I don't want to play with you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> and then you drop them onto the floor. They just yeah, they just drop. Unless you're Ivy Stern, you can turn into a dragon who has wings. And then you're just like, no! Anyway. Alright, right, so. Don't get your shield broken pretty, again, Mouse Rat. Yeah, not this time. Oh my god! <laughs> so both of those things whiffed on shield, but like, they were like so close. That was terrible. I just, I just respect the fact that Noel was like, okay, I didn't hit him. But I'm gonna aim up Dragon a little bit to catch him jumping. Ooh. Yo, sick parry! Too bad it's Min Min. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> it, it's one of those things that are good. Uh, those are good things to parry just because, like, it, it's kind of like clockwork with the next punch coming. Uh, it's like, it's like, yeah, I'll block one and then I'll just. Ugh. And they got punched in the face. All right. Okay, good roll in from uh from Null. Oh, up smash reflected the T Joel. Ooh, okay, that might not be enough, but, but it's not going to. Just jump in. All right, oh. it worked out. Okay. You know what? I respect that. I was. Oh, bro! Is it over? I it's over. He it might it, be dead. It... Okay, it's not yeah. over. He took 40 damage from that. He he really did, huh? Okay, well. <laughs> um. That's the second lease on life if I've ever seen one. Mouse Rat, get your shit together. Uh, <laughs> like, Bro, there's a platform literally up there. You can use it to recharge your shield. Like I'm not trying. I'm not downplaying Null. Null's doing great, but like, let's not hold our shields like that. Like, goddamn. Yeah. Ooh. Not wow. against the character throwing a literal bowling ball. All right, Trogdor online. Well, Mouse Rat at 100 damage. This is a super good position. Oh my god, I really like it. I would have got hit by that. I absolutely got hit by that. That was such a sneaky megawatt. Oh, you know, Mouse Rat has nice. a little bit of space. <gasps> Never mind, he's alive at 120, dude. Bro, if you're gonna <sighs> ju if you're gonna have the T jolts like help you like anti edge guard, you gotta get on stage while they're still on like. No, <laughs> that's it. In effect, dude, he got deleted. What the hell? Oh my. Uh, it was in fact a 45 minute set, so congratulations, uh, Mouse Rat. You were 75% correct on how long it would take. Can I get the actual time though, Devin? Uh, how long did it actually take? is 30 minutes. Oh, it was half an hour, so he's 50% wrong. Never mind. I have such mixed feelings about Min Min. I want to see how she does offline, honestly. I'm not saying I'm not trying to say that she's carried online or anything because I do feel like there's a lot of genuinely good players that play her. She definitely like just has a Wi-Fi power up, but we haven't seen what her meta looks like offline. Yeah, that's what I want to see. Yeah, it's like, bro, like how, 
like you're figuring you figured out how to play the character very well off online i want to see like how effective she is uh when people are more able to parry because i feel like that's gonna be a big thing but the fact that she has so much power especially to hit off stage that's potentially much scarier 